In this explainer video, we're going to go over a typical learning module. As I mentioned in the welcome video, you will spend the majority of your time in the learning modules tab. Right now, your learning modules tab looks like this. As we move throughout the semester, more and more modules will open up and your learning modules tab will look more like this. As you can see, the majority of the content is delivered through this learning modules tab to include your midterm and final examination. Let's take a look at your first learning module. The part one learning module covers chapters one through three. When you open up the part one learning module, you should see along the left hand side a table of contents for the learning module. You can use this table of contents to navigate through the learning module. In the alternative, you can use the arrows in the upper right hand corner to navigate through the learning module. You may remember from the syllabus overview explainer video that you will be evaluated based on four equally weighted categories key terms and quizzes, class participation, your midterm exam, and the final exam. Here you can see that each learning module will contain assignments that match up with the first two categories. Just as mentioned in the syllabus video, you will see here that additional instructions for each assignment are provided before you begin. As a reminder, key terms assignments may be attempted as many times as you like and only your highest grade will count. The idea here is that you will continue to attempt this assignment until you have a good grasp of the important terms and you should be able to achieve a 100 on these assignments in every learning module. Quizzes may be attempted up to two times with only the highest grade counting. Class participation assignments may be attempted as many times as you wish. Remember that class participation assignments are pass-fail, but I will use a rubric to grade each one. The final element in each learning module will be a weekly attendance check. And these are simple surveys meant to help me track your attendance and participation. More information is available on, in the explainer video under the attendance policy tab. As always, don't hesitate to reach out to me with questions, and I hope you have a great day.